Bob Harper, 5 Things to Know About the Biggest Loser Grainer The Biggest Loser's Bob Harper is currently in recovery after suffering a heart attack that reportedly occurred while he was working out at a New York City gym two weeks ago. Harper, 51, first appeared on the hit weight loss show as a coach, known for his motivational style, and became the host of The Biggest Loser ahead of the show's 17th season in 2015. Here are 5 things to know about the reality fitness star. 1. He came out as gay on the show in 2013 to encourage contestant Bobby Salim to come out to his father. I haven't talked about my sexuality on this show ever, Harper said on the episode. I really do believe this is the right time. I want to show Bobby that he doesn't have to live in shame. Being gay doesn't mean that you are less than anybody else. It's just who you are. Harper said on the show that he had been out since he was 17, but hadn't addressed his sexuality publicly until then. 2. Former contestant Joelle Gwynn alleged that Harper encouraged her to take weight loss drugs during the show. Gwynn, who competed on The Biggest Loser in 2008, told the New York Post last May that Bob Harper, who was her trainer, provided her with drugs during filming. I felt jittery and hyper, Gwen told the post of the one time she took the pill she says she was given. The next day, the show's resident doctor, Robert Hizango, gave us some lame explanation of why they got added to our regimen and that it was up to us to take them. People chastise Bill Cosby for allegedly offering meds to women, but it's acceptable to do to fat people to make them lose weight. I feel like we got raped, too. Harper denied the allegations. These allegations are absolutely false and are in direct conflict with my lifelong devotion to health and fitness, he told people at the time. Safety is paramount in my training regimen and, while demanding, my approach has always focused on the overall well-being of contestants as they lose significant weight and educate themselves, for the first time, on living a healthy lifestyle. 3. He has a rescued dog named Carl. Harper rescued a terrier sheets a possibly Havanese mix, who was found on the streets in Baldwin Hills, California in 2010. He is the best dog in the world, he previously told People. I love him. I didn't even want a dog, and all of a sudden I met this little one and he needed help. I took him in and it's been the best thing. 4. He has two full tattoo sleeves on his arms and is obsessed with tattoos. I've just always been someone who has been obsessed with tattoos, Harper said in a video shared to the Biggest Losers Facebook page. I've loved them ever since I was a kid, the very first time I ever saw my dad's friend with this sailor tattoo. I was like, whoa. I thought it was the coolest thing in the world. So now I have two arms filled with tattoos. His favorite tattoo is a hand tattoo shows a skull on a heart surrounded by a spider web. It means nothing but I just think that it's so tough, he said. I love it. 5. He's a New York Times best-selling author. Harper's weight loss advice books The Skinny Rules, Skinny Meals and Jumpstart to Skinny all made the NY Times bestseller list. 